Well, it's October in the vegetable garden and things feel like they're coming to a close. Or are they? A lot of people discount the winter garden and they think about the vegetable garden as just being a time of the year for growing tomatoes and squash and some of the really fast growing vegetables, but there's a lot of things that you can grow when it gets a little bit cooler. For instance, October is the perfect time of the year to start setting out your, your bulbs, your onion sets, uh, uh, the garlic sets, the, you know, the seeds for onions. There's a lot of things you can start growing chives. There's also a lot of cold weather crops that are just perfect to put in now. You know, amazingly, we've still got the last of our tomatoes. And while the plants are starting to go downhill, don't give up on them yet. Don't give up on them until they, they really get hit by that first frost. But do gather in the tomatoes. Pick all the ripe tomatoes now so that the green tomatoes will get a better chance to, to ripen up. And sure, a lot of the tomatoes are starting to rot and there's a lot of problems associated with the first rains. But if you pick a lot of the green tomatoes, you can set them aside and it, it takes sometimes several weeks for them to, to ripen up on a windowsill. If you're fortunate enough to live in Zone 5, like I do, you can get away with a lot. You know, this is also a good time of the year to start paying attention to some of the plants going to seed. This is just a flowering sweet pea right here, but if you want to gather seeds, now's the time to do it. You know, if you wait for even a few weeks, these things will all pop up and you won't have any. These are great little things to add to the garden, and you can see that they're, they're very attractive. They draw bees. They're, They've got a beautiful scent to them, but uh, don't, don't forget about gathering up some seeds and getting ready for next year, or next spring actually. You put these in the ground in the springtime and they'll grow most of the season. And you know, just because it's getting a little chilly outside doesn't mean that you got to quit digging. Get out there and get to work.